the richest copper kings to the lowliest miners. They all worship together here in this church at one time. St. John's Episcopal Church has been open for more than 140 years and it's small but dedicated membership works hard every day to keep this historic house of worship open. is a continuously running church since 1881. The doors have never closed on this church. This church needs to be here because this is a historic church and it's only really meaningful to the people of Butte. This was the church of Copper King William Clark who bought and installed some of the church's intricate stained glass windows which are truly works of art. Probably it was their economic wealth of the time that gave us these, these beautiful windows by J.R. Lamb out of New York City. Um, there were two other stained glass manufacturers in Butte that day, but they brought the best in from New York. Clark also bought the church's pipe organ, which was erected in the church in 1895. Oh yeah, this thing knows how to make some noise. There's over a hundred pipes for the organ of this St. John's Church, and it really is an amazing piece of equipment. It has such a beautiful sound. It's um, bright, and it's a great pipe organ. Like many churches, St. John's has seen a big drop in membership in recent years. But the church is trying to get more active in the community to encourage others to attend. The current congregation is older, but it's dedicated to keeping it going. Yeah, I think it would be too sad if, it, if we couldn't keep it going. But we're trying and we're praying and we're believing. And with God's grace, we will be here for another hundred years. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.